Shelley's going to start up this morning for the West. So he slips in a gully. In the air, just oh, wide a bit on. I reckon he's got a hand on a page. Well, it was pretty well hit. You talk about Sutherland, the way he hits the ball and how hard he hits it. That was out of the middle of the bat. Well, we'll have a look. He chipped in the air. Catching chance. Daniel goes down. That's, yeah. Don't quite work out who that is. Lance Morris, I think. <laughs> Mate, try and face him in the nets. That's a good shot. So this is uh, good batting here from Will Sutherland. That's what I'm talking about. It just seems a bit easy. Yep. Edged away. More runs for Victoria. Mm. More runs. That's what they want. Have the biggest ticker with the bat, David. He sort of. How many overs did he have to face? Went leak side of the ball. And I think there was about four, maybe five overs left in the day, and and Spencer had two or three of them. And uh, we remember sitting up on that little viewing platform in the old Wacker, and Spencer bowled a bounce. Oh, that's a oh. good shot. That's a number three. See, that's nice that Mitch Perry batted four hours in the final last year. Beautiful shot. That's a great Perry, shot. Perry, just a little bit of width. Kelly changing his angle. I, I like the approach here from Victoria. They are, they've definitely gone, OK, look, we're not going to save this in terms of time. We're going to score run. Fifty for Will. Yeah, that's a good fifty, isn't it? In the final, he's got over four hundred runs in the Sheffield Shield competition, and an average around about thirty. More runs, racing away here at the Wacker. Should be a boundary. It is. Second one down through that area. It's a big one for the captain. Mm. Edged yeah. away. Big breakthrough. Gee, they're looking solid. Victoria, Matt Kelly. Picks up his third, really well bowled, good delivery. Copy of the last ball. Mitch Perry edged that one down through gully for four, but this one straight through to Josh Philippi. There was that little three-quarter seam, wobble seam going across the left hander and just left him enough. Beautifully bowled. Bowls him, first ball, cracking delivery. Not too much you could do with that for Fergus O'Neill. So Kelly's on a hat trick. Angled in. No feet. Oh, on the top of off stump. Just watched O'Neill's feet. The cardinal sin of batting at the Wacker or anywhere. Caught on the crease, not forward, not back. It was apprehensive. With a brand new one. Lovely shot, Todd Murphy. <laughs> Beautiful shot. Waited for that right onto the bat. Oh, that's a shame. One of the great blokes in the air. Just over. Yeah, so it looks like Sutherland is going to take. Gapped it. He's gapped it, but it's probably only going to be one. Oh, he's coming back. Oh. Murphy was slow there, Daniel. There was half a chance for a run out. Full and driven beautifully by Todd Murphy. Free flow of the bat. Picks up four. Beautiful shot, Todd Murphy. Particularly given the circumstances we just spoke about. Morris bowling short at him and his field set to bowl short. Full from Paris. Edged just over Gully. Almost spooned over. Murphy gets four more. Raced away. Pretty tall guy, Aaron Hardy, so... Elevated, but not quite. Just a little bit of swing from Paris. Nicely struck. Oh, Todd Murphy yeah. again. Found the gap. There wasn't much space between... Full from Morris and yeah. driven handsomely by Todd Murphy, who is looking in fine fettle at the Wacker. Moves to 22. Down the wicket and bang. 
that is struck superbly by Will Sutherland, a maximum. What a shot that is. Will Sutherland. Reminiscent of Brendan Julian in that highlight package we watched earlier. It's a beautiful shot. A little shimmy. Beautiful strike. That's a big hit. Beautifully played away. There's a man out there. Avoids Roccaccioli and gets four. Brave shot by Murphy. Taking him on. Beautiful strike. By having that leg gully, it means that the man out, that deep square leg, has to be in front of square. 50 partnership DC for Sutherland and Murphy. The off spinner certainly holding his own. One, Yabba. In the air, gone. Breakthrough for Aaron Hardy. Todd Murphy goes for 26, flashing it a wide one. In Western Australia now one wicket away. It was wide, it was full. Oh, there's a nick, but there's no third slip. And there's that third man, Brendan Julian. We've spoken about it. How many runs at the Wacker to the tail? Got to have a third man. Ray, look at these two. Down the ground, it's in the air. It could be out. That's the end of Sutherland. It's a shame. He took it on. Ashton Turner at long off. The trap was set. Sutherland obliged. Hardy gets his wicket. And unfortunately for Victoria, and unfortunately for Will Sutherland, a wonderful innings comes to an end. 90 runs the difference. Western Australia in the driving seat. A shame for Sutherland. Yeah, it is. Yeah. Gee, he played well. I mean, it's it's very hard for Will Sutherland because he's got to work on the leg side in the air. So I get that trap. I love a short leg in there. Oh, so that one there. Yep. Now I'm... Oh, runs. Yeah, through the gap there. Drive. Square drive and it races away. The new ball on the bowling green. First boundary to Bancroft. Big appeal from Scott Boland. Oh, Figure goes up. First one down for WA and it's Scott Boland who gets the breakthrough. WA skipper Sam Whiteman sent packing for a third ball duck. Just held its line. That is a yes. lovely ball. Salmon Trout, DC. That looked like that was... Edged through the slips. There's three of them there and a gully. No one at third man, four for Teague Wiley. Oof, way down leg side from Boland. Four buys. Edged and dropped. Short and Hanscom almost getting in each other's way. In first and second slip. Harper does the feeling. Back for a couple. Fatigue Wiley. A little bit from Boland and Wiley in an attacking frame of mind. Can get all of it. Another two. Full driven and through the slips. Thick outside edge. Gully diving away to his left. And haul it in. Boundary for Bancroft. Edged through the gap again. WA riding their luck. Wiley outside edge. He moves to 18. Shots, a lovely shot. And a boundary for Cam Bancroft. Yep. Going out on a high. Width and length. Bancroft pinned the ears back there. He saw it timed it beautifully middle of the bat. Raced away for a boundary. Ball cricket. There it is. Oh, well, went between third slip and gully. And guess what, Brendan? Four. Four runs to third man. Wide half volley from Perry to start his spell. Teague Wiley has no hesitation in climbing into it. Chase from Marcus Harris.
Sam Whiteman and John in for rarity with WA's 17th Sheffield Shield title. So a nine-wicket victory for WA. They go back-to-back. -back. First time they've done that since 98-99. Here we go. Boys are going to celebrate. I'm sure long and hard into the night. They've had their fair share of celebratory moments. With two triple crowns in consecutive seasons, they are the dominant force in Australian domestic cricket at the moment.